Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be something a little bit different. For a review Wednesday video, I am going to be testing out two different makeup removers. And the first one I actually thought was a brush cleanser. It's the original makeup eraser, the number one reusable makeup removal system in the world. It's a sample and it's supposed to erase all my makeup with just water. This is what the sample looked like and it says makeup eraser will erase all your makeup with just water. Erase erases mascara, eyeliner, blush, foundation, and more. This includes waterproof and smear proof makeup, reusable, machine washable, will last three to five years. And then it has a bunch of comments on the back by different magazines. You open it up and it shows you that this is just a piece of the sample, a piece of the original, it's a sample, and that you simply wet your pre-wash sample with warm water, the wetter the better, and a circular motion gently removes mascara, eyeshadow, blush foundation, and more. Be amazed that all your makeup was just erased with water. Okay, and then it says a no about saving 25%. You can use the code ipsy25 at makeuperaser.com. So this was a sample I ordered forever ago. I ordered this when I lived in my other house and this is soft, like a blanket. I'm really curious to see if this is gonna erase my makeup, but also because I bought the Face Halo in a three pack and I saw Rob, Re Rob Beauty Christie use it and I've used it three times already and it is amazing. And then I can stop buying makeup wipes and stop buying um, like makeup microcellular waters because I can use this and then cleanse my face like normal. So I'm gonna use the makeup eraser on this side of my face and I'm gonna go get my face halo and wet this side of my face with it. I'm gonna be using two clean ones and I'm just gonna go wet this with water. Okay, so I'm back. I have my hair in a bun and a headband on to get any fray little pieces, put it back. So I'm going to be using the face halo on this side and the makeup eraser on this side. I have a towel in front of me because both of these are still dripping wet and they're really warm. So I'm going to start with the makeup eraser because I've never used it. And I'm going to go down half of my face. And if you just watched my flawless base video, I do this eye and face look. And you can see exactly how much product is on my face because... It is a lot. So I'm just gently moving this around. Just taking it off. I don't know if it's any faster or better than the face halo because I feel like the face halo gets it off faster. And I'm really curious to see what is in these that takes it off. Like, am I rubbing chemicals on my face? Okay, so this one definitely takes some of it off. You can see it on the sponge, but I don't think it's taking it off as well as the face halo does because I still have eyeliner on and I don't want to rub my eye. So... But barely softly rub that in, it will take it off. But it is, it just frayed a little bit. I saw a pink thing on my face and I do have to kind of scrub and it kind of irritates my eye. Like it feels rough and it's flaking it off. And I feel like I have to rub to get it off. Like my eye hurts now. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a face halo which, like I've said, I've only used three times. This one definitely maintains water more. You can see that that one, I don't know if it's because it's white versus pink, but I barely am putting any pressure on my skin and it just glides off. Look at that. 
So I'll use this one side for this one part of my face and then go back over the makeup eraser side so you can see. And what I like about this is I can fold this, like for instance, the eyeliner and hold it. Or if I want to, I could rub it and it will get that off. I have too much water on this. Again, this one flakes the eyeliner off. But it takes it off smoother. Okay, so that's the whole side. I'm gonna flip it back over and see if we pick up any more product on this half of my face. Did the makeup eraser get it all? Did the face halo get it all? Let's find out. Okay, so that's the makeup eraser side. This is the face halo side. Now let's take this and go back over the face halo side and see if I missed anything. Ooh. Okay, it stayed about the same besides my mouth area right there. Face halo side, all of my face side. This is the makeup eraser on one side, and that is the side I mostly did my eye on. And I can see by looking at this that there's tiny tears in it. I can see the camera through it. I don't know if you can see it, but you can see light in there. So it's very thin, whereas this feels very sturdy and put together. Like if I stretch it, it doesn't break apart. This one, if you stretch it, you're gonna rip it, I think. My face feels clean. It's tingling like, hey, I feel clean. And then what I would do is take my Tatcha uh, blue moisturizer and wash my face and then go back over it with like a moisturizer. Um, I think they both did an okay job, but I prefer the face halo. I've only used this three times, but look how much more makeup that got than this. And when I went back over it, there was still makeup in my face that was missed. And I'm not okay with that. I'm not about to waste money on a product and it not get everything. I know that you go back with a cleanser, but for me, this fabric feels too scratchy on your face compared to this fabric. And... This one's thinner and not as durable. So this was a good thing. Um, I will probably continue to use it, probably in my makeup room, but this one is my preferred one and it comes in a three pack. And these are incredible for the environment. I'm going to stop using makeup wipes because this has completely changed my life over the past week. And if you want to try this, you can go to MakeupRazor.com and this code right here is Ipsy25. I don't know how many times you can use that, but it says you can save 25%. The Face Halo is online. If I can find a coupon code, I will link it down below. If not, if Raw Beauty Christie has one, I will link that one down below um, because that's who inspired me to purchase this. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Otherwise, thank you so much for subscribing. And if you wanna see how much makeup was on my face, go watch my flawless base video and you will see everything that I put on this face and how I took it off. So yeah, and thank you for watching.